All right, Wolfpack Nation, we are back, baby, for part two of our interview here with the new head softball coach, Lindsey Leftwich. If you haven't checked out part one, make sure to go and do that first and foremost, and then come right back here so we could talk about her goals and aspirations for this program. So, Coach, I want to talk a little bit about something that maybe a lot of state fans don't really know, which is that this softball program is only heading into its 20th year as a program <laughs> uh, at nc state as a softball program at nc state which when you compare it to some of the other programs elite programs in the country is very very young and uh, you know looking at that you're only our fourth ever uh, head softball coach that we've ever had and you know you look at the opportunity here you know you kind of mentioned earlier in part one about how much, how competitive the acc has become and you also look at the fact that last year we were last place and they see six and 18 overall uh, in ACC, that there's a lot of opportunity to leave a legacy and to really build a program here. But it's, you know, with the how good they see us, it's not going to get any easier. Um, you know, what are your kind of thoughts about, you know, the, you know, turning this over this program and making it, you know, towards the top of the ACC? Yeah, I, I mean, I think that was a huge reason I took the job. Like, it was like, you can win here. And you can be competitive in like in the ACC. And I think you can do it really fast. Um, I think that a, like just looking at NC State as a whole, like you see the growth of women's athletics. And I think like seeing that happen from an administration standpoint and then the women's teams like bolstering forward, that was so enticing. And that was like, hey, like that you can do that. And they're, and NC State's going to care about that. And, and women's athletics matters. And you can't say that everywhere in the country, like at all. And so that was a huge part of this. And then on top of that, I was like, I, I can win there and I, I can be successful there. And there's no reason that NC State shouldn't be in the top in the conversation to be 